Imani alleges that the fuel trade is owned by my own good friend, Dr. K.K. Sapon, and his family. And then this gentleman must be a very rich man by now. <laughs> eh? Then he must be a really rich man. Dr. K.K., as we are aware, it's one of the best brain in terms of what he does at GMPC. He's the chief executive officer of GMPC, and he had very, very good experiences throughout his life. As young as he was, he was one of the first youngest chief executive this country has produced. It is on that basis, and because of his technical competence, capability, and the understanding to help this country out of its current predicament that His Excellency appointed him to head the GMPC. As a minister, I know the capability of this man, and I do not doubt his level of integrity. However, we wish to inform you that fuel trade came into the petroleum agreement during the NDC regime at the time Dr. K.K. Sapong did not know if ever he will become the chief executive of GMPC. And under the NDC, we are all aware of the kind of politics that was practiced at that time. You either belong to them or you are not part of the cake. And I don't see how they were going to open the door as His Excellency Nana Akufuado has opened the door to everybody. If Dr. KK managed to get his way through then, then kudos. But I can assure you that the current beneficiary owners of fuel trade, it's common and visible for everybody to see. All that you need to do is to walk to the Registrar General and determine who the true owners of fuel trade is.